Hi, Rook. Once upon a time, a while ago, <laughs> we went to somewhere dead exciting. We went to Las Vegas, baby. We made it. We made it. And we went to Speed Vegas. So those of you that know me well know that I'm a bit of a petrol head. <laughs> like I've only really realised this in the past, like, since you got the Mustang. I didn't realise it beforehand. You didn't realise it. Every time I went to America, I drove a Mustang. Well, I knew that, Like a stove. I thought you like Mustangs, but I didn't realise that you were that much of a petrol head. Mm. Like I really didn't. Because you go to car shows now. Yeah, you go to car shows and everything. It's like, it's, it's just a love of mine. But mm. Yeah, I think I've obviously got more into cars since yeah. I've had the Mustang. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah, so we went to Vegas, um, and in this video, I'm going to show you what we did in <laughs> Vegas. What you did, because I was, I was too hungover to do this. Yeah, Adam was um, way too hungover. Um, but yeah, we're going to do a Speed Vegas nail. So we'll concentrate on doing lettering, and we'll go through step by step of how to map out lettering and things like that when you're doing this on a nail, because lettering can be quite difficult so I'm going to talk you through that obviously it wasn't the only thing that we were there for we weren't just there to, to go drive to, to drive, drive like you know a Mustang Shelby but yeah it was fun so I've got a plain black nail you can use void to make your nail black obviously that's our way black gel polish but then you want to top coat it and mat it off with a buffer so you're just going to buff that shine away what, you, what we're going to do is we're going to map this out with a pencil now this is just on a plastic nail and you can see you can draw on it and you can buff it off, buff it off like it's you know like a rubber <laughs> that means something else in the stage okay like an eraser <laughs> like this on the end of my little retractable pencil. Now I call them clicky pencils, so if we ever need them in the office, I say, can we order some clicky pencils? Yeah. Vanessa knows exactly what I mean. So if we look at the logo, it's on a straight lines. Oh, this this is, look at the logo on my chest. <laughs> I don't know how appropriate this is, but um, yeah. So if we look, everything's on straight lines. Mm. So you're gonna work with lines first of all. We're gonna do it down the nail like this. So at Speed Vegas, there are different things you can do. You can race exotic cars. So there's like exotic car racing, there's go-karting, there's off-roading. The off-roading looked pretty cool. I, I did think that. Yeah. If I went back, I think I'd have to have a go with that. If I wasn't that hungover, I would have done that. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely. Right, so I've got 
our file here and I'm going to draw a line directly down the center so if we mark that's the center then we go to the tip so I have a guide so can we just about see that line then you want to mark out how deep the letters are going to be when I look at that they're not they're not overly deep they're quite long so this is a guide it doesn't need to remain the same it can change You wish you could just do that with all planes. Do you know what I do? <laughs> you do actually. Yeah. <laughs> I've heard the bones snap. Because you've got to turn them round, get them, get them in the position that you want them in, not the position that they want to be in. Because <laughs> you are doing the nail art, not the Pain client. Pain is beauty, lady. Pain is beauty. Yeah. So if we look, the tail end of the S is here. So I've marked that there. And then we'll have the tail end of this S. And I've got to fit it on. I've got to try and get it there. We might not get every last letter. We might have a little bit of that S missing. But let's see. So the tail end's going to go there. We're going to start the V there. So what you're going to do roughly is write the word speed Vegas. And you're going to do the first and last letters first because that will be your beginning and end so we're working in this portion here that we marked out so there's your bottom line there's your top line okay so we've got the v and the s the g is going to go in the middle once i get that g in and the e figure out if I can pull this S a little bit further across. That G went a little bit too low. So let's just adjust that. Vegas, baby! So just wedge that on there. So that's five letters. There are also five letters in speed, which kind of helps us. So we know we can fit that on. Well, if you just freehanded this, what I find is you go bigger and bigger and bigger. Each letter as you go, you naturally mm. go bigger and bigger and bigger with the letter because your confidence gets a bit higher yeah. and you just start making it bigger. Mm. So it's it's easier to just map it out. You know, whatever text it is that you're putting onto the nail, map it out first. It's a whole lot easier. Speed, Vegas baby. Just have to say baby at the end, don't you? <laughs> I know it doesn't say baby, but we have to say speed you Vegas. Need to baby. Nail for that one. Yeah, <laughs> another nail. So we've marked that out. We're going to be using tag. So if those of you have got this colour and you are struggling to pronounce that, because if I didn't know how this was pronounced, I would be like tad hag. <laughs> tag it's tag as in tiger tag it's a um irish name named after andrea's son um where's my little palette gone <laughs> have you tidied up i know we put things away and then it just i should never do that i should have only left them Maybe we can just use the um ah, the play button. <laughs> we could use the play button as a palette. <laughs> Maybe. You've already got enough on there, I think. There's enough jar polish on that. Okay. Right, so we're gonna take tie because I'm gonna do the
bottom. The bottom? Bottom. The Vegas, basically. Doing Vegas. Vegas, baby. And I'm going to use the Messy Nessie brush. That is our smallest brush. It's itsy bitsy teeny weeny. Yellow Vegas speed me somewhere up there. <laughs> <laughs> Right, so let's just have a little look at this now. Because I'm just thinking I might have put white in. Just to brighten it a little bit. Yeah, it is quite dark, isn't it? Mm, it is quite dark. Seems darker than me. Because it's on black. Let's mix a bit of Isaac with it. Yeah, it's sort of like between the two, isn't it? Mm. This is what I love about gel polish, you know. You can just make your own colour. That's better. I think had it had been over white, it probably would have been the right colour. Notice how I'm balancing with my own fingers. Not Aliana's fingers. So we've got the top section of the E as well as the V. Because it is joined up, you've already got those little markers from top and bottom, so you shouldn't get carried away if you follow those markers. What was your favourite part of Vegas? My favourite part? Mm. I don't really know. Not the heat. Not the heat. <laughs> like, the heat was ridiculous. It was. So we went on like, the first, well, second week of July. Mm -hmm. And that's apparently the hottest. It gets. <laughs> it's like you just go outside and turn into a ball of flame. Yeah, you could literally just cook. You could make a barbecue on the sidewalk. Yeah. It's that hot. I. I think it was the, the, the just the scale of everything. Yeah. Like, everything was just huge. That was like quite. I didn't quite realize that. Like when you're walking up the up the strip, yeah, everything's just the buildings are huge. Like I don't know, just it was it was that was weird. Looks like a toy town. Doesn't like it like it's real. It's not real. Yeah. Um. What was your favorite area? I'm not. I'm not quite sure. I, what I liked and also disliked. Was you know the shopping malls where it's like doesn't matter what time of day it is, it's the same time of day. Yeah. So it like just totally tricks you. Yeah. Like everywhere is, because it's twenty four hours everywhere pretty mm -hmm. much. It's it was so weird. Because you don't know what time of day it is yeah, once, you, you, once you're in those malls and yeah. those um, casinos. Yeah. That's matter. totally the idea, oh, though, isn't it? Yeah, it is. yeah. It is, yeah. But yeah, that was that was a bit. Mm, um, what else? Fremont? Yeah, I think that was probably... Yeah, Fremont was really cool. That was what I was trying to remember was the, yeah. the name of it. Um, that street was class. We had some fun down there. Oh, it was so good. Live music. Yeah. That video screen thing was just great. It's amazing, isn't it? <clears throat> yeah, that was fun. That felt like um, just party town, that bit. Yeah. Everything else, I, like some of the bits, of it, I was a bit like, oh, this is too swanky for me. I'm not into the swanky, swanky places. What, where we went for the first meal? <laughs> Is that too swanky? Yeah, it was too... Well, no, that wasn't too swanky, actually. That was... I liked it. It's chilled, but, you know... I quite liked it, but it felt a little bit... Pretentious? Yeah, no. No? I don't think pretentious. I think a little bit um, commercial. Yeah. Like, it was like, look at us. This is a cool place. You have to be cool. To be any, yeah, and it was a bit like, well, actually, no, that's not quite right. But no, I, I, I just think like Fremont was just a bit of like, yeah, you just let your hair down. Yeah, I love it there. It's I always have a great time at Fremont. Yeah, it was good. I enjoyed it, and listening to you scream as you just went past in that car. <laughs> 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 Oh, when we were in the Dodge. Yeah, the, the, that was fun. Yeah, in the Dodge Charger, that was that was fun. 
Adam wouldn't come in that. I kept oh, trying. I would have you wouldn't, but do you know there. what? Once we were in it, I was like, yeah, Adam would have thrown up by now. <laughs> the alcohol would have come straight back out. Mm. Yeah, very much so. Definitely. Well, I really liked the air conditioning. <laughs> the air conditioning was my friend. Yeah. You'd, it hurt to breathe at some points. It did, yeah. It burned. Like, yeah, it, it felt like fire going down your throat. Yeah. You think, how can, like, can you really get used to that? I know, because we were talking to, like, taxi drivers and that, weren't we? And they were like, hey, you just get used to it. And we were like, eh? And then how? you'd be freezing if you went anywhere else. Yeah. So I'm just going over the top just to make it a little bit more rich with colour. But I'm not adding a lot, just... A little smidge. The funny thing about going to Speed Vegas and, you know, driving a Mustang Shelby was, I was in a room. They do like a briefing. Mm. So in that briefing room, I was the only girl in there. Yeah. The rest were just like men and boys, you know, young, dumb and full of c um I'm not sure we can say that, but... <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah, young, dumb and full of... Yeah. The guy went round and asked everybody what they were um, driving. And most of them were, like, um, Lamborghini or Ferrari. You know, total, like, expected. I expected all those young... Porsches. Yeah. And I was like... And they asked me, and I was like, um... The... Shelby. The Shelby. And they went, oh, you've got the most powerful car. <laughs> and I was like, huh, oh, you guys. <laughs> and I think they, they turned around as if like, oh, oh didn't realise that I got the most horsepower. <laughs> oh, yes. I mean, one of my favourite things was the Dodge Challenger. <laughs> Going in a car, a Dodge Challenger, um, with a stunt driver it was pretty amazing. It was better than any roller coaster I've ever been on. <laughs> right, so we've got the Vegas bit done. I think yep. it looks pretty, pretty close to mm -hmm. the, to the, to the, to the thing. Um, so now we're going to do speed, but we're going to do it in white. So we're going to use white out. Pop that onto a palette. And again, we've got those markers there already. So, I mean, because it didn't take me that long to do that. Whereas if I tried to freehand that, I would have made so many mistakes. I would have had to keep going back, taking it off, and I might have thrown it through the window at that point.
So let me take off the excess with the kitchen towel dry when you're doing, when you're cleaning off your palette. Take it off dry, then go in with clean up solution. Because you'll just spread it otherwise. Yeah. So go in dry with your, with your kitchen towel dry. If you went in with wet kitchen towel with clean up solution on, just, yeah. It will spread everywhere. So we're going to get rid of the pencil lines now. Clean up solution, lint free pad. Give it a rub. And then any lines that were there before will now be gone. Just let that dry. And then we're going to top coat. Matte or shiny. I think shiny. Shiny. So this is our glossy top coat. No sticky layer. So you don't need to wipe off the sticky layer. It's cured and then it's done. And let's cure that. Zoom, 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 zoom. <laughs> zoom. Do you know what, on that video, I look like I'm going really slow, and I promise you I'm not. <laughs> but I'll tell you the one thing about Speed Vegas that I did find frustrating. Yeah, you've got to, like, follow what the guides, what the guy, yeah. guide, and or the guide. Do faster. Yeah, I kind of wanted to just thrash the <laughs> out of it, to be honest. But, um, <laughs> obviously, there are safety measures when you are racing cars. Um, so I had to abide by the rules. I wanted to go faster, really. But mm. I thoroughly enjoyed it and the staff were absolutely amazing. It was great what to do. It was dead relaxed. Everybody was just yeah. happy. It was dead chilled, even though it rained. What they did when it rained is they got all the I'm cars out. Really cool it was on it, yeah. <laughs> so basically, I bet they love it when it rains. Yeah. But the staff are like, ah, come on. <laughs> so when it rains, all the staff go out in all the cars and razz round this track and dry the track up. I'd be like praying for rain all the time if I were it there. <laughs> <laughs> so there you are guys I hope that's helped you with lettering and how to sort of map that out and everything like that and I hope you enjoyed um, watching me and Vanessa scream our heads off <laughs> and Adam thoroughly laughing his head off at us um, at Speed Vegas yeah so there you are everything I've used today will be listed below as always um, don't forget to check us out on Facebook as well which is Kirsty Meekin Nail Artist and TikTok is Ghost of Making and Instagram is Ghost of Making. They'll be linked below. <laughs> right, guys, see you in the next one. Ta da, duck! Go as fast as you want to go, okay? Yeah. Shift up. Break. Shift down. Cool. Eyes up to the right and turn. Green to green. Point the car to the outside first, and then accelerate. Brake here. Turn it. Slow your release that brake. Middle of course, eyes up to the right, turn to the right. Second green cone here, to the green cone here on the left hand side. Good. Now middle of course. Now you're going to stay on the left. Eyes up to the right, turn to the right. Turn more. Brake here. Harder. Now slowly release the brakes. You're still breathing, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they take some serious concentration. Yes, it does. It really does. Brake here. Well, let's put it this way. You're finished. Yay! And you didn't make me nervous one bit, even with it being wet out there. Oh, do you know what? I felt like that top corner was was the hardest to do because it I felt like I wanted to. to I'm sorry, I felt like I it's wanted okay. to go faster. <laughs> So but yeah, then I was that, like, yeah, the the the, the, the arse end of this car feels like it's ready to just start. Leap out. Even the traction control was coming on down the straightaway too. Yeah, yeah.